gado cia monya muno muiro radio wa Jata TV thini wa tafarira ya Rushi ni rwega ni gukorwa ikarito mitambo ine ni twashokereria na dagishokereria ndina mugeni thini wa studio uyo tushereire kuma kuria carboni ya safaricom na reke twabe tumunyite ogeni karibu sana asante sana aha takupatia a chance to say hi to the audiences okay. everyone in the country including the people from your company okay. safaricom thank you very much my mm -hmm. name is richard mune mm -hmm. I work uh, at Safaricom mm -hmm. and I am the trade marketing manager for uh, Mount Kenya Northeastern region. Mm -hmm. Safaricom has six regions. Mm -hmm. One of the regions is Mount Kenya Northeastern region. Mm -hmm. So we have split the company into six regions so that we are able to reach all our customers equally. Mm -hmm. So a customer from Western Nyanza has an office in Western Nyanza, mm -hmm. from Coast, from Rift, from Mount Kenya Northeastern region, and from Nairobi, Nairobi we've split into two, Nairobi East and Nairobi West. Mm -hmm. So it becomes easy, we, we're more reachable to our customers. Mm -hmm. So now I head marketing in Mount Kenya Northeastern region. Mm -hmm. yes. Safaricom, you had a slogan by the name, the better option. Why change the slogan to transforming lives? <laughs> I think I think uh, I, I thought uh, the better option was even the better slogan than every, the transforming lives. Yeah, everything ev everything that lives grows, mm -hmm. and Safaricom is alive, mm -hmm. and we've grown over the years, many years now. We just celebrated 16 years mm -hmm. at Safaricom, mm -hmm. so we've grown with time. We started with providing network. We started with providing per second billing. Mm -hmm. We uh, came up with data and Pesa. Now we've grown. We, we grew to uh, the better option, mm -hmm. uh, which we held that slogan and we held it in our hearts for some time. Mm -hmm. Then we realized we, we, we've grown past that now. It is about time we, we get into our true roots, mm -hmm. which is transforming lives. Mm -hmm. So what, what does our network do? Mm -hmm. Our network transforms lives. What does M-Pesa do? It transforms lives. What does internet do? Mm -hmm. These days, people are able to do their studies on the internet. It transforms lives. Mm -hmm. What do we do on social impact? M-Pesa Foundation, Safaricom Foundation. Mm -hmm. We transform lives. Mm -hmm. So now we are in transforming lives. OK, thank yes. you. I, I, I came to realize that you've come up with an offer you are offering the, your customers, eh? Yes. Tunukiwa. Yes. Uh, what is Tunukiwa? So, uh, in an effort to reach our customers better, like I started explaining through our regions, we went further and segmented our customers. So, our customer is not just a basic one, one customer. Mm -hmm. we, there's no silver bullet to our customer. So, every customer, depending on their needs, their ways of life, where they are, how they, they spend their day, mm -hmm. we segmented them, and we ended up with four segments. Mm -hmm. So we have the designing professionals, the people who wake up in the morning, go to the office, work eight to five, go home in the evening. Then we have the youth who are in the universities, the twins who are below, below 18 years. Mm -hmm. Then we have uh, the hustlers, mm -hmm. people who every day are looking for a way of life. And then we have the mass, mm -hmm. the mass customers. So for all those segments, the youth you've heard about Blaze. Mm -hmm. uh, for uh, the hustlers, you've heard about Flex, sure. Flex units. Flex, yeah. Yes. And now for the mass customers, we have Tunukiwa. Mm -hmm. So we've been doing many things over the years on, Tunu on uh, the mass customers. Uh, recently, we had Story Bambe. Now we have to Nukiwa, mm -hmm. which is still addressing these customers mm -hmm. and giving them an everyday offer. Mm -hmm. So every morning you wake up and you check on your phone, mm -hmm. star for for hash, mm -hmm. and you're told what offer you get. Okay, it, before, before you get to that, how yes. does it work, this to Nukiwa? Uh, one, it is available to all prepaid and postpaid customers. Okay. So what you do every day, you dial star for 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 hash, mm -hmm. triple four mm -hmm. hash. Then you will be given a message which tells you you have an offer for how many minutes talking, how many. Uh, is it data. basically for the data? For no, the... it is for data, SMS, and minutes okay. of talking. Mm -hmm. So you're given that offer. You're given many options of the offer. Then you can select. Mm -hmm. The offer you select, that airtime value is deducted from your airtime in okay. the phone. Okay. Then you will receive a notification on Tunukiwa and an SMS as well mm -hmm. that you're now on Tunukiwa. Then for the period that the Tunukiwa is valid, you don't now spend on your airtime. Mm -hmm. Yes, you spend on Tunukiwa. Okay. The twist to this is that uh, Tunukiwa is 24 hours, mm -hmm. so it's valid for 24 hours and or depending with the offer you are given. So the offer will explain to you how long the mm -hmm. Tunukiwa will last. Mm -hmm. You cannot ambassador Tunukiwa. 
it's your offer, it's personalized, it's for you. So you cannot sample that to someone else. Mm -hmm. And uh, Is this something that has started or it's yet to start? Because I've never seen a message on my phone about Tunukiwa and I would like to know how do I get eligible? Uh, okay, mm -hmm. we, we started on 11th of April. It is running for three months, mm -hmm. all the way to 9th of July. We will be, this is part of it, telling our customers okay. that we are doing this for mm -hmm. three months. Mm -hmm. We're we'll giving them an offer for three months. Three months. So, so you, will, yeah, you will be receiving an SMS, mm -hmm. you'll be seeing us on TV, you'll be seeing us on radio, okay. you'll be seeing us on print media, on billboards, and we'll be coming to your market. Mm -hmm. For example, now, like uh, I've explained to you on the regions, we have caravans running all across the country mm -hmm. in various regions, telling our customer that we have to Nokiwa. Now you can get an offer, an everyday offer for you to look for. So you. comparing it with Okoa Jahazi, most of uh, the hustlers they are used to the Okoa Jahazi. Yes. Uh, what, what is the difference? Do you, don't you think Okoa people will tend to prefer Okoa Jahazi as compared to the mm -hmm. Tunukiwa? Uh, those they they actually gel in mm -hmm. because Okoa Jahazi puts airtime into your phone. Mm -hmm. Tunukiwa bundles that airtime for you. Okay. So you can still Okoa, and then. Once you acquire, you have airtime on your phone. Mm -hmm. Because Okoa is the same as loading airtime onto your phone. Then now you use Tunukiwa to bundle that airtime into an offer. Mm -hmm. Yes, so they jelly, they work hand in hand. Okay. Yes. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Then I, I would like to know how do I get the services if I am a customer? I've never received any of the messages. Yes. Uh, as a new customer, how do I get the services? You dial star mm -hmm. four 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 hash. Star four 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 four. four. Hush. Triple four. Triple four. Uh -huh, hush. Yes. Then okay. you'll receive a full menu telling you the offers available and it's personalized. It'll, you know, we, we, we have you in person. It will call you by your name, Mudoni. Uh -huh. like that. Ask Kenyans you like Sambaza. Like, can you Sambaza me the Tunukiwa offer, for instance? Or mm. can I Sambaza a friend? Now, wa, Tunukiwa, you cannot Sambaza Tunukiwa. Mm -hmm. For the basic reason is that Tunukiwa checks at your usage and your daily consumption mm -hmm. and your pattern of consumption. So if, for example, I am heavy on data, that means I'll get a lot of offer on data as mm -hmm. opposed to SMS and voice. Mm -hmm. that, that means it is my, my offer is not your offer. It is different. And we, we don't have a reason to Sambaza because everybody can access to Nukiwa. There's no reason to Sambaza. You can access to Nukiwa, mm -hmm. I can access to Nukiwa. Mm -hmm. And once your Tunukiwa is over, you can uh, dial again, star mm -hmm. for four hash, and get another Tunukiwa. Mm -hmm. So it, 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 it delegates the need for Sambaza. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, you said it last, the offer is lasting for three months. Eh? Yes. What about the daily offer? Uh, for instance, uh, I subscribe to the Tunukiwa for today. Yes. As compared to the Okoa Jahazi, whereby yes. you Okoa five bob, then mm -hmm. you're supposed to pay maybe uh, five bob for five SMS plus five MBs. Eh? Mm -hmm. uh, what about daily? Uh, how, how long does it last? Per day. The Tunukiwa, mm -hmm. 24 hours. 24 hours? Yes, 24 hours. Okay. Yes, but if you exhaust before 24 hours, mm -hmm. you can always get another Tunukiwa. Okay. Yes. Then I would like to know about 4G. I think most of the people, the viewers, would want to hear this part because uh, mm -hmm. internet, especially in Safaricom, yes. I think you are the best person to ask this question about bundles in Aisha Sana. Everyone is complaining, but I don't know. Maybe you're in a position to explain that better. Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. uh, I will start with the first question you asked about 4G. Mm -hmm. So we are the first company to offer 4G mm -hmm. in Kenya. Initially we were doing that in Nairobi and uh, Mombasa, but now we've rolled out to another 30 towns mm -hmm. in Kenya. Mm -hmm. So all regions in Kenya now have 4G. We have 4G in Garissa. Mm -hmm. You know, we have 4G in Nyeri, we have 4G in Kisumu, we have 4G in Meru. We have 4G in 30 towns and- 30 towns? In 30 towns. Okay, Is it, does it mean that include the, the six regions you just mentioned? Yes, 30 okay. towns okay. now in, in the whole of Kenya. Mm -hmm. And we are upgrading. Currently we have, you, you see those boosters you see, we call them sites. Mm -hmm. Now we have, 4,600 sites on 3G. Mm -hmm. Now we are in the process of adding 4G into them sure. so that our customers can have reliable mm -hmm. network, mm -hmm. internet, mm -hmm. all through. Now what does 4G do? 4G is fast. It's very fast internet. Uh -huh. it, 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 the, there is no buffering. If you go to YouTube mm -hmm. on 4G, there's no buffering. Mm -hmm. There's instant upload, instant downloads. 
you access internet faster in a more reliable way. Mm. And it is also in a better clarity. If you check on YouTube, there's the option of the kind of clarity you can get on every video. Mm -hmm. 4G offers you the best. Mm -hmm. Yes. Does it mean it's expensive? Because I can imagine if you're watching something from the YouTube and it, there is no buffering, then yes. it's just straight to the point. Does it mean it will consume more of your credit? Uh, no. The way you can look at this is you can watch, um, uh, you know MB is MB, mm -hmm. regardless of how fast you consume the sure. MB. So if you watch a 5 MB video mm -hmm. on YouTube, mm -hmm. you watch it for an hour, it's still 5 MB. Mm -hmm. If you watch it for uh, two minutes, like a normal music video is three minutes. Mm -hmm. it's still the it same. is still the same. MB. Sure. So the notion that it is expensive is wrong. The flip side of it is mm -hmm. it is faster. Sure. So you you get you get quality for your money faster. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, okay. Before you, we get to the uh, you asked about data burdens. Yes, yeah, data burdens. Uh, we have smartphones, and smartphones have background uh, applications running. So what happens is sometimes we forget to switch off background applications. Sure. When you sleep and your phone is still on data and it's running background uh, application, mm -hmm. it still continues to use mm -hmm. your MBs mm -hmm. to keep your phone updated. Mm -hmm. That's why when you wake up in the morning, you have all your WhatsApp, mm -hmm. you have all your Facebook, everything ready. Mm -hmm. Now, that provides convenience. So depending with your lifestyle and how you want to manage your data, sure then you can decide to, to keep them running or to stop them from running. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, then I think uh, everyone would want to know uh, like how, how oh, oh, the regions you've mentioned about Nairobi, Mombasa, Nyeri, yes. what about, does it not apply to the people in Ushago, Mashinani? W what does not apply? 4G, 4G. It is 4G. there. It is there in Mashinani. Mm -hmm. For example, if we look at my Alemi Pika region, Mount Kenya Northeastern region. Mm -hmm. We have 4G in Garissa, Embu, Meru, Nyeri, Nanyuki, Thika. All those are machine learning places. Mm -hmm. if, yeah, so we, we have gone to all towns. Initially, we started with only two towns, mm -hmm. Nairobi and Mombasa. Okay. But now we've gone to all towns in the region. Mm -hmm. All major towns, name it. Mm -hmm. We are there in 4G. And we're expanding mm -hmm. time by time. Now we're in Karatina. Mm -hmm. We're in Moranga now. Mm -hmm. Yes, so we're expanding with time. Mm -hmm. yeah. well, okay, Safaricom is known to be a very big company, especially in service delivery and all that. Eh? Yes. And I think I've seen most of the time you they giving back to the community, social yes. social interactions with the community, those people in the livelihood. Yes. Maybe some of the community, some of the services that you've given back to the community, just to mention a few. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so uh, Safaricom has to, we're big on CSR. We're big on giving back to the community, and that's mm -hmm. why we are talking about transforming lives. Sure. Now, we have two foundations. Mm -hmm. One, you've had the Safaricom Foundation, mm -hmm. and we have M-Pesa Foundation. Mm -hmm. Safaricom Foundation deals with, you know, the, the small... Oh, M-Pesa is a, is a... It has a foundation on its okay. own. Yes. So, Safaricom Foundation, the, the one you know now, the one which is known by everyone, mm -hmm. runs the small, small projects in the communities. So, we have our key pillars of the projects we run under, under these two foundations. Okay. So, we have things on health, on education, economic empowerment, mm -hmm. environment, mm -hmm. arts and culture. Mm -hmm. So, uh, for example, if we, if we look at um, some of the projects we've done, for example, on economic empowerment, mm -hmm. we, we have just, uh, we've just commissioned a big farming project for Kibicho Secondary School. Sorry? What? For Kibicho for Secondary Kibicho. School. Yes, it's in Moranga. It's in education or economic? That's econ economic empowerment, economic, uh -huh. yes. So what do you do? So we, we have done for them the infrastructure, okay. the expertise, mm -hmm. for them to be self-sustaining and run a big farm. So they can sell, get money, you know. It, it, we, we, we there hold, and hold them to teach them how to fish, mm -hmm. not just give them the mm -hmm. fish. Then we also have the Hika Water Project in Madeira, this is in Nyeri County. Mm -hmm. So we go and we find a community that is struggling with water, mm -hmm. and there's a lot they can do with the water, irrigation, drinking, uh, kettle, all that. Mm -hmm. We partner with them and we get what their needs is. Is it pipes? Is it expertise? Mm -hmm. Is it uh, digging of the trenches? Mm -hmm. Then we get 
into a collaboration with them mm -hmm. and we make it happen for them. Again, we've done that mm -hmm. to a tune of 500,000 shillings. Mm -hmm. On health, we've just equipped and commissioned and completed construction of a maternity wing mm -hmm. in uh, Kigoji Dispensary, that's in Meru County. Okay. Uh, that's again to a tune of 500,000. On education, we have uh, donated textbooks to Keria in a secondary school in Matioya at a cost again of 550,000. Mm -hmm. We are on very many things water uh, and for the and PESA Foundation, mm -hmm. you know about that. Where, where does Dakaini fall under? Because I, I think it's one of the CSR that I have participated, the Dakaini Marathon. In. Yes, uh -huh. Dakaini Marathon it now falls under the, the, the foundation is CSR basically. Uh, mm -hmm. Now what you've said is now a sponsorship, which we, we, we are big in Dakaini okay, Marathon. Okay. So we come in and we partner with the organizers mm -hmm. under sponsorships mm -hmm. to see the run come to life. Okay. Yes. Okay, so you sponsored the marathon? Yes, we sponsored okay, the marathon. Okay, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. The M-Pesa? The M -Pesa, M -Pesa as, a, as a foundation? Yes, m -Pesa Foundation, again, tackle the same pillars, but mm -hmm. not in a big way. Mm -hmm. So, for example, you know about the M-Pesa Academy, sure. the one in, in, mm -hmm. uh, in Thika. Mm -hmm. It's a big, big establishment for the Mpesa Academy. Mm -hmm. And that that's just on the education side. Wait, wait a minute. Mm -hmm. If someone wants to apply a job in Safaricom yes. and yet you have not gone to this Mpesa Academy, does it mean I'll not get a job with you? No, Mpesa Academy is actually a high school. Mm -hmm. Offering but, but, 844. Uh -huh. So it's a normal school where we take uh, kids, talented and bright children, mm -hmm. and needy. Mm -hmm. So those three criteria. Is it connected to the services or it's no, just an academy? it is a high school, 844 system. Mm -hmm. We just make the school run. So the name Mpesa, it's just a name like any other Yes, name. it is a name because okay. of the ownership of okay. the school. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you should take a tour there. Okay. It's a nice, nice school. Mm -hmm. Top of the range, yes. Mm -hmm. Let's In, go back to the Mpesa as a foundation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So as a foundation, Mpesa handles the big, big projects like that one. That's a multi-billion project. Mm -hmm. And when we, if, now, once we're done with that, then we pick on to the next project, another big project, then now MPESA Foundation mm -hmm. handles that. But again, the pillars are still the same mm -hmm. on education, health, economic empowerment, and such. Okay. Yes. What about art, arts and culture? Arts and culture, we are big in arts and culture. Mm -hmm. We sponsor uh, music events. Mm -hmm. You recently uh, heard about the jazz. Jazz Festival, yeah. you know that that promotes music in our country. Mm -hmm. We are in culture, for example, in, mm, let me pick a region like uh, Mount Kenya again, mm -hmm. in the eastern side of Mount Kenya, we have cultural events, we have the Ameru Music Awards, we have the Lake Turkana cultural event, where we go in and partner and sponsor, so that we make sure that this, these talents don't go to waste, mm -hmm. they're discovered and they they come to light. Mm, someone sees right. them. Yeah, mm -hmm. Someone sees them. Mm -hmm. Because if you're in Turkana and you have a talent, mm -hmm. who will see it? So we make that talent come to life. Okay. Yes. Ah, sawa sawa. Murole ni nitafarire ni arushini rwega no iragithie na mbere na tukoba wikiri yohanini nigetha tushokereje twi na Richard Mune kuma kaboni ya Safari Comire ya Naga Services shadimo o hamwe na Mpesa no ngikoro na kiuri ogyo then no kiuri ko hitukira na Beo 0701171717 mudono abugo twi na Stephen Richard Mune sorry kuma kaboni ya Safari Com twikiri yohanini netogo shokereje.